Lakes region. Yeah, he joins us live in Meredith this morning. Uh, Ray, icy roads, not the only concern this morning, right? That's right, Sean. One of the other big concerns this morning as you take a look at those flags there is the wind that is accompanying this storm. Now, utility crews say that they do have crews on standby. Utility companies, I should say, do have crews on standby to deal with the expected power outages. We're getting reports of a couple of hundred power outages right now. Here in Meredith, there's only about an inch of snow on the ground, certainly not the three to six inches that we were expecting. But what is happening right now is this you <laughs> Uh, ice that is falling and that's creating the very slippery conditions. It also could start to build up on the lines and that could lead to those expected power outages. Anytime you have a mix of sleet and freezing rain, um, the potential for precipitation, um, you have the concern of possibly trees falling onto power lines um, and scattered outages. One of the best things you can do is just prepare a storm kit with essential items. Uh, make sure you have bottled water, um, non-perishable food, flashlights, anything you think you might need if the power goes out. As you take a live look at the roads here in Meredith, you can see they are snow covered. Traffic is moving. We have seen the plows out, but